Alright guys, so I'm back. Basically we're gonna do a no mirror makeup challenge. Um I know you can't see, but I have a lot of makeup. Everything is kinda of coming. So this palette for example, I kind of um, taped up the mirror so you can't see it. So I'm gonna first clean my hands because you're gonna I never ever use brushes to apply. Um, so sanitizer my hands. She mean? Yeah. You got no chance. I'm gonna begin. I don't really know where to look. So I usually start with a primer. I don't know if you can see this, but uh, yeah, it's kind of running low. I usually start with primer all over my face for foundation because my face is gross AF. So I'm gonna apply. I don't even know. Okay. I don't even know what I'm doing. Using. <laughs> This foundation. This is actually a really good foundation. Revlon Color Stay, and I'm uh, in the color 310. Um, I'm gonna just squeeze a good amount of my hands. Gosh. Gosh. I, kinda, I don't even know how much foundation I'm putting. So, this is gonna be hard. One eternity later. So, now I take this one and I just kind of Blend it like that. So, using my L'Oreal True Match um, concealer with very specific. I do about three swipes. And I have like a few pimples here, so I'm just gonna dot it right in the middle. I use the concealer and corrector in light. I'm so scared because this is so light, so if it doesn't blend well, I'm kind of screwed. Right now, as I think about it, I'm the most scared about eyeliner. I'm literally like a pig drawing eyeliner, like with like three left hands or something. Then I use this white super fresh CC cream because it's also in the wrong shade for me. It's actually very pink. Oh shit, that's too much. Okay, I think. I'm trying to set everything and my powder. I can open it. For blush, I use a lipstick for my blush. I don't use any blush colors because I don't like powder blush, so I'm gonna use my fingers for this as well. Put it on. I think I use too much. Oh no, my it's great. Oh no, my it's great. Then after that, I use the Bobbi Brown Shimmer Brick in Rose and I pick up the brush and I use the top a few colors. I don't like to use the pink parts, they look very nice. Then I do my brows. So I pencil in the front part of my brows. Like I look like I have a McDonald's sign on my eyebrows. Taking a spray bottle, I'll just spray my face. This will probably try, try, try. So I'm gonna apply this color all over my uh, inner corners. So this is just a transition shade. Now I'll take a fluffy brush and I'll blend it in soft sweeping motions into the crease. And then we apply a darker shade into my crease. Take a fluffy brush and fluff it out basically. I'm scared. I'm so scared. I can't do this even with a mirror, so take a we take a black and we mix it with like a little bit of that shade. I usually put like more black, I like the shade, so I'm gonna apply it only to the outer parts of my eye. A fallout, fallout. I don't look like a panda, that's like my ultimate goal. Everybody was kung fu fighting. So I'm gonna just take this gold color and we'll apply it all over my eyelid. 
Okay, go and curl my lashes. This is like the most terrifying part. Do you even think I actually curled them properly? I'm not gripping the ends because I'm too scared. Too scared. Highlighter. I'm gonna just try to focus and like not poke myself. So I can feel it. I only like like two coats of this color. This takes me like 30 minutes to do. Okay. So I'm not kinda excited. One, two, three. Oh gee. Wow. That's interesting. <laughs> I think that looks like something I would do. So, um, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed and uh, stay tuned for the next video. Okay, bye. Bye.